Good morning, C Freight in Chicago with the morning grain comments. Prices for grains are a little bit lower led by wheat. First of all, the Chinese stock market was down almost 4% overnight. That's offering some resistance to the market. And then this week, the market's going to be watching the Fed and see if they raise interest rates or not. As far as anything else going on, uh, USDA uh, kept corn ratings at 68% good to excellent versus 74 last year. And we've got about 5% of the crop harvested versus 9 average. Um, we are pick, seeing a little bit better corn yields as the harvest progresses in Illinois. Uh, but elsewhere, uh, yields are still lower than what farmers had hoped for. Um, bean ratings dropped two percentage points to 61% good to excellent versus 72 last year. Uh, ratings dropped in Arkansas, Minnesota, which was supposed to be our best state, and Indiana. Um, like corn, ratings are down in Illinois, Indiana, and Ohio, and Missouri from last year, while Iowa and Minnesota are higher. Uh, winter wheat plantings are 9% done, that's close to average, and topsoil moistures are drying out in Arkansas. Uh, parts of Illinois, Indiana, Ohio, Kansas, and also Oklahoma. We also noted that uh, there were some analysts last night that went to the trouble of looking at the USDA September price analysis versus fourth quarter lows, and their correlation suggests that January beans should be near 840, December corn 335, and December wheat 460. And that would be a 2.5 soybean corn ratio versus 2.28 now. Others are talking about $8 beans and $4 corn, which would be a ratio uh, near 2.0. So a lot of volatility still left uh, in these markets. Overnight was clear, should be clear and warm, at least for most of this week, maybe a few showers across the northern areas on Friday. Six to 10 day is warm and dry. Eight to 14 day is also warm and dry. Fun still short a few beans, short wheat and long corn as we go into what should be uh, a good harvest uh, weekend and good harvest uh, next week. So we'll be watching the Fed. Uh, we'll be watching farmers selling. It did pick up yesterday a little bit on yesterday's rally in corn. And we'll be watching uh, the Chinese news and Chinese data for market direction. As always, these are my thoughts, not those of ADM or ADM Investor Services. And have a safe and profitable trading day.